I really thought I was done, but I wasn't done. I wasn't done at all. How can I miss this? I literally went. See, I thought I was done, bro. I looked at this and wow, I can't believe it, y'all. I really can't. Let me check this. See if the audio is cool. Alright, Steph PG3 here, and I've arrived back into Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. And I decided to just go through it one last time before I switched to Vegeta's because I was about to do it. Vegeta, I was about to start Vegeta's, and I discovered this. I can I completely missed this. Yeah, yeah. That 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 leads in like I completely just didn't. So now I gotta redo this fight for y'all. So y'all can see the cutscene. I didn't watch the whole cutscene. I skipped it once I realized the fact that it branched out into something completely new. <laughs> Jeez, bro. I'm gonna make sure I really I, I really gotta I'm gonna clear up all my mistakes in this path, bro. I don't I don't think I blocked this. Yeah, let's we already starting off bad. We're already starting off bad. We just gonna retry that off rip. The fastest way, like you just When you play all the other bosses for you can realize how easy Raditz is now. I feel like he he's so easy to And then like he typically forgot where I was, so I kinda have the advantage after this. He literally See look, he literally doesn't know where I'm at. Bro, I was literally trying to do. Are you serious, bro? Let me find out, bro. That's over, bro. I feel like it's over. There's no way, right? You kind of just squindle, bro. Maybe we did it wrong. I don't think we got the dialogue. Well, the right one. If we get the cutscene, all right, all right, we did it. We did it. I don't think he's got the will to fight anymore. Someone who want to kill all my friends and family is no brother of mine. Now you better get the hell off this planet and never come back here again. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't want to set. I want to put this in a video with the last one, so there don't gotta be two extra videos. I'll figure something out, bro. Piccolo just It's kinda weird because they don't have the whole throwing, but the fact that if Goku didn't move his head, bro, it would have went right through his head. That's insane to think about. You saved my life, Piccolo. If you hadn't made a perfect shot, I'd be lying on the ground with him. I got Piccolo walking up. Bro, he walked up like a true OG. Your friends would just revive you with the Dragon Balls shortly after, anyway. The, the Dragon Balls. Yeah, 
All seven combined have the power to grant any wish. Even if it's bringing someone dead back to life. I feel like I know what path this leads down to. But I'm not going to spoil it. Because it's definitely a path. It's definitely some what if that I didn't see yet. That I kind of got spoiled. What? Well, not spoiled. It was shown in the trailer. So, you know what happened. Him, he's saying that like he like he isn't the one rising on the ground right now. Buddy's in so much pain. Like, and a year, a pair of sins will come after hearing read its words. Goku immediately invites Go invites Piccolo to help him train. In addition, Piccolo suggested they convince Chi Chi to let Gohan take part. Goku is sure the training has made him stronger. In the meanwhile, the two Saiyans are approaching Earth. It's honestly insane that in two different what ifs, Goku just doesn't, if he doesn't die, he just never gets Kaioken. Of course! You've already gotten way stronger than me when I was your age. We just need to keep up your training. Don't you agree, Piccolo? Oh, sure. But he'd be a lot stronger than that if he wasn't being spoiled so much. Aw, don't be like that. What are you so nervous about? Come on, Gohan! Buck up! Right. Thank you very much for the opportunity. Okay. Let me check. I gotta make sure this doesn't branch out as well. Do I just beat him? Alright, just test his power. I'm really mad that I didn't see this in the last episode, bro. Like, ah! I could, it could have just simply put it in there, bro. Easily. Like I said, I'm gonna figure something out. Oh, they showed up mid mid training matches. Insane. I feel like Goku would, at this point would. I feel like he'd still be too weak, right? But then again, everybody is alive, so I feel like it is enough of them. Goku is the current Corrin Tower and immediately returns to join his companions after receiving sensu beans. Goku senses that something significant is going into and going to happen in this battle. No, he prevents Yamcha from dying here. You're a lifesaver, Goku. Wow. Of course, you must be That's insane, bro. You got a lot of power. <laughs> I can tell just by looking at you. That's wild, bro. He Goku, just comes and saves Yamcha's in the nick of time, so he doesn't let's die here. That's kind of crazy. And I don't care. I don't care. I don't care about the health. And like no other fight. But a Cyberman should not have that much health, bro. Come on now. We we know what the Cyberman about. We know that man. That thing is not strong, bro. You know what's funny? I was literally about to do a Kam Kamiyamiha, bro. Sometimes I hate that you have to charge this, bro. Bro, see, that's what I'm talking about. I'm trying to do the beam, and they got me punching. 
I feel like they they should they have to fix that. Got to. Also, then the game officially releases today too. And you with a grab. They haven't really gotten anything new. The only thing we got new recently was the Android 18 outfit. After they successfully defeat the Cybermen, Nappa is the next opponent to appear before Goku and his friends. Tien steps forward to fight Nappa, but both he and Chaozu are immediately overwhelmed. Goku joins the fight and manages to save Tien. That's kind of crazy that Goku was just really preventing a lot of deaths. Goku, your fight's with me now. Better make it a good one then. Snap that. Did he have super armor in the regular? Nah. I think he does have super armor. Yeah, Napa, stop all that teleporting. I'm not one of those, bro. Look at him. Nah, that's that's kind of disrespectful, bro. He just laughed like that while you. Bro, he got up so fast. What? Why does he have meter smash? Oh, we got Teen Alpha 3. I've never really did the move. Like, I did it, but it always whiffed. Why does he have this? Jeez. I never thought I'd see the day when Nappa is actually bodying Goku. Goku eats the sense of bean he had in his pocket and makes a full recovery. He didn't notice the changes in, to his body. Buddy just received the Zenkai boost. When he turns the face, go on. Oh wow! What a moron! Only thing he changed was the order I'm killing you in. So Piccolo still dies. Unfortunate. Thanks to the sense of being Goku recovers, but during that time, Piccolo dies defending Gohan. Goku orders Gohan to leave the field of a battle. He bought the two v one. Take Piccolo and leave. Get as far away from here as you can. I can't afford to lose you. Dad. Let's do what he says, kiddo. If we head back to Kame House, Bulma should be able to preserve Piccolo's body. Yamcha, make sure Gohan's kept safe. I promise. Don't go dying on me. Look at Goku being a good dad, guy, bro. Late, Goku. Even if Piccolo's body is preserved, he. I know. Which means the Dragon Balls would be gone forever, too. No, it's not hopeless. Even if he dies, there's still a way. Do you know what's bad about them? Them, them like, let's say they just beat everybody. They really they failed the because they killed Piccolo. Before you guys got here, those aliens referred to Piccolo as a Namek. Realized something important as a result. I'll explain all the details later, but for now... Yeah, we gotta focus on winning this fight first! <laughs> you can save some time and attack all at once! Just another few bodies for the pile! Well, our 
Vegeta's still my fighting, so. He really just let me not nah, affect that he really just let me charge up in his faces. You really thought you was about to cook me with that, bro. Computer really like I did like they really be spamming that. How do I just okay, I guess I just with that. I guess. How did he still have super on Alright bro? Bro, that throw kill nah, that had to be the cut the dialogue, right? No way to throw kill D. I have no use for a paralyzed saying. You're dead, wait. The fact that the Saiyan saga has the most what ifs is beyond me. Seeing that is dead weight oh, Vegeta kills him without a single thought. I mean it's not really though, because it makes sense. to even be able to lend a hand. Yeah, but... Yo, let's finish this someplace else. Fine by me. Makes no difference. So they still end up having the 1v1. Tien and Krillin watches Goku and Vegeta take to the sky. After finding a place where there are no humans or animals, Goku and Vegeta each assume their fighting stance. And so, and so the battle between Vegeta and Goku begins. I feel like I feel like Vegeta definitely beats Goku here. It's just a fact. I don't care if Goku just received his Zenkai. Vegeta still beats him pretty easily, maybe. I don't. Maybe probably. Nah. I, I feel like it's probably easily, bro. Cause like when you really think about it, like unless the Zenkai really made him that much stronger. The trend. Let me see something. I just really be having to check this. He does it mid fight. Wow. And then he. Okay. Does it mid fight and then and then he uh, super armor okay so not only do you really just have to wash vegeta completely he okay i'm pretty sure he was blocking was he not this how you this how you beat him, bro. That's what you have to do. Does he know where I'm at? How did he know where I was at? Okay. 
once you get sparking, you you pretty much cool. You go through the super armor, so you're fine. But okay. All right, bro. I'm sleep, bro. I'm sitting here thinking he's about to. I knew I was going to have to fight the Grey Eight, but dang, like they just let him transform mid battle, bro. Jeez. Goku loses consciousness from Vegeta's attack. It seems like a desperate situation, but just then an ally appears at Goku's side from out of nowhere. Bro, so this is another Senkai he received. Goku receives a sense to be from Tautu and recovers, but Goku sees his friend's defeat at the hands of Vegeta. Gotta fight him again? Oh, no, it's a spark. Oh. Is he dead? Then he destroyed the moon, the artificial. Oh, oh, wow! You shut your mouth. With Piccolo dead, Dragon Balls are gone. And Krillin, he's already been killed once. I can never be revived again. Look at the fear in that man's eye. Ever forgive you for this? Oh, nah, Vegeta, it's over. Whooping Vegeta's ass. <laughs> Yo, oh my lord, bro. Look at that difference in health right now. I like how this 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 Super Saiyan Goku basically have two different ultimates. How can I be outclassed with some pathetic creature? Bruh. Does he still I feel like he still lets him live though. Shortly after Goku faints, when he when he awakens, Goku is Gohan is there. He grieves over losing precious friends in the Dragon Balls. He remembers Krillin. Krillin mentions the planet Namek. If it, it is then that Gohan Gohan recalls the conversation between Vegeta and Nappa, they have spoken of the possibility of Dragon Balls on planet Namek. With help from Boma and Mr. Popo, they get their hands on the spaceship.
Goku seeing sensing that something will happen, makes up his mind to go alone. While Go while Boma arranges a spaceship for Goku to use on his own, Goku focuses on training. It is then that Gohan approaches him. Is this about to continue? Goku arrives alone on planet Namek. Before him lies a terrible scene. The mech and body strew the ground. Goku's dark premonition has become a reality. Bro, are you serious? Look how Goku. Wait, <laughs> please don't run away. Eek. It's okay. I'm not gonna eat you or anything. Bro, this is a bro. I thought it was just gonna end at the Saiyan saga, but bro, this is so interesting. He just shows, he just goes to Planet Namek alone? Bro! Bro, this changes everything, bro. Because if he unlocks Super Saiyan already, that means, well, then again, he probably, he most likely don't know how to do it again. Bro, this can, I was not expecting it to go this far, bro. Nah, they just cooking on the what ifs here. We're officially Goku mid once again. I feel like you, you play with Go. I feel like you play with Goku mid and Super uh, Goku the most. You really don't play with N to Z Goku like that. You fight like a total of like maybe five fights, and then you count the what ifs too. So you gotta add them. Damn, I just watched that Freezer Soldier free. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, you count those. Goku Med really has the most fights. If you take out Goku Super, at least. I feel like Goku Super and Goku Med definitely has the most. Vegeta's a Super Saiyan? Goku now stands before someone resembling himself. Vegeta has awakened to his own Super Saiyan powers. Vegeta too is searching for the Dragon Balls. Now he stands in Goku's way. With Freeze out of the way, my fight is with you now, Kakarot. Now become a Super Saiyan immediately! Did he kill Frieza? The sparks of their battle are about to fly once again. Bro, did he? What do you think, Kakarot? Now I too can transform into the legendary Super Saiyan. Nah, bro, this is fire. <laughs> oh, I see. This little guy's an Amekian. To bring everyone back to life, I have no choice but to take down Vegeta. What are you waiting for? Turn Super Saiyan? Or would you rather just lay down and die? <laughs> Maybe he can? Oh, alright. I was about to say he was training, so he has to have like mastered this at this point. Is this what you wanted? I'm not playing around. Indeed. For killing you in this state is the only way to reclaim my honor. I pushed myself to the verge of death to improve my strength. But despite my greatest efforts, I knew deep down that I still hadn't reached your level. But then, Bro. the endless rage invoked by the humiliation you left me after our last battle, I became a super saiyan and killed Frieza with my own two hands. So I think Nah, that's insane. Well, now that you killed Frieza, bro. Oh, uh, I was about to grab. Like Simple, because the universe has no room for the weak. So why don't you join me? Nothing will be out of your grasp. What do you say, Kakarot? Oh. I have everything I could ever need, he... Vegeta. Get ready to see my real Oh, I get angry coming on me right now. Out here. You 
it's over, Vegeta. Does this also lead to the end? Does this have its own thing? Does it go into the Andrea saga as well? To truly be a Super Saiyan, you've got to be pure of heart, awakened by fury. That's what I am. Nah, he cooked him and then told him what it is to truly be a Super Saiyan Your is insane. Helped you reach the transformation, but you still lack what it takes to unlock its real power. Nah, he just disrespecting him right now. Next time you feel ready, you can bet I'll be ready too. Kakarot, you're a true Saiyan after all. Then the next time we cross paths, I'll be stronger. Strong enough to crush you once and for all. Saiyan so basically let Vegeta leave again. And so Goku and Vegeta's Super Saiyan rematch comes to an end. Our hero looks on as his newfound rival takes his leave from planet Epic. Goku triumphantly returns home to Earth to celebrate with his family and friends. Their world now at peace. Wow. Goku continues to improve himself. One must wonder how much stronger will he become? Only time. His next challenge will tell. Bro, that changes a lot, bro, because that means Trunks is never born. Because Vegeta. Ve we got Vegeta GT. That's fire. I was wondering how you got him. Okay, bro. Wow. Before we. Let me, you know. We gotta check again, bro. We really gotta make sure that we're not missing anything before I end this video. Make sure we got all our little side quests out the way. Jeez, bro. It's kind of crazy that I have to do this, but after what just happened, it had to be done. Then again, I feel like this this dessert. I, at first, I didn't think it was going to be that long, but this definitely deserves its own video. I, I respect it. I was not expecting it to turn out like that. I knew about the little, the grade 8 part. I knew that would, the path that had to lead down to. I didn't think, I didn't know about the Super Saiyan, like, Vegeta, like, was going to turn Super Saiyan and then body Frieza. And, like, like bro, that's crazy. That's, that's insane. I, th I, I think, I think we might actually... I think we might actually be done here. I'm going to say that, but I'm going to still continue to go forward until I actually know if we're done here, bro. Because that's insane. Got so many different brands. Like, I didn't even peek to, like, notice that one, bro. I think, all right, we're done. We're done. We're done. Because I know for a fact there's nothing up here. Alright. So, like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe if you're new. Turn post notifications on. If you uh, haven't already bought Vegeta GT, that is how you unlock Vegeta GT. Um, and, yeah. Uh, I also, I got to tell y'all something. Um, I figured out how to unlock Android 13 as well. I'm really trying to unlock all the characters how they are, like, the uns anyway, like, not just buying them. I could easily buy them, but I just think it's more fun to unlock them, you know? So, uh, I found out you unlock Dr. Willow by playing as Dr. Duro ten times. And I believe you also unlock Android 13. Now, you uh, it's either you play with Dr. Duro five times for Android 13, or you play with Cell five times. It's one of them. But no, 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 maybe no. Nah, it's 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 Doctor Row. You play with Doctor Row ten times. You should unlock 
Android 13 and Dr. Wheelo. Um, most of the other characters, like uh, Khalifa, really just play the bonus battles. Play through all the bonus battles, you unlock, you're going to unlock plenty of characters. Um, I, that, that's one way. And then, unlocking Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, you just, I'm pretty sure y'all probably bought him, but you play with Gogeta 10 times. Uh, unlock Baby, you play with uh, Vegeta, any form of Vegeta. I gotta put that out. Any, any Vegeta and Gogeta, just play with them 10 times. Um, I believe, I believe that's it. Uh, then, then make sure you play through all the world tournaments. Play through all of them. Finish them all. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm done, Chad. I'm done. Alright, y'all. I, I don't know if I'm going to record the Vegeta one after this one. I probably will start it. But I'm out, y'all.